or move on. Hey there, it's on fire here. And welcome back to Horizon Forbidden West. Uh, last time, uh, we uh, went ahead and got through the uh, sacred grounds, which uh, we have officially captured as our base. Now, uh, let's go ahead and listen to this little rumor real fast. You're the outlander who stood against Regala and her rebels. Yes, me. Only if it means we're good here. Don't worry. I'm not here to drink your blood, or whatever you Easterners think we do. The slaughter at the embassy wasn't your fight, yet you stood by the marshals. As far as I'm concerned, you're no enemy of the Tanakh. But you are going to need help if you plan on surviving the clan lands. I hear and see many things as a scout. I could share them with you, aid you on your journey. I'd be grateful. Well then, be careful if you're traveling southwest, champion. Rebels have set up camp in the hills. I'm sure they'd be more than happy to dig your grave. Thanks for the warning. The hive, huh? Sounds like the Tanoth could use a hand dealing with these rebels. Let's check with Hunter real fast. Frost and acid. Let's go ahead and go just take, take care of that right off the bat. Uh, the story here is pretty. Like, this game is gorgeous and. I can catch my breath here. Multiple ways. I, I think I I'm confident I have said that several times, but. great thing about uh, this area is I can go through and gather more resources again. One more step. The Tanakh don't suffer outlanders in the clan lands. I was given right of passage by Marshal Fashav. I'm not here to fight. Hair like blood. This is the warrior who defeated Gruda, champion of the traitor Regala. Her life is not ours to take. You may enter, but mind our ways. You will be watched. I'll keep that in mind. Yeah, I can take you all out. I don't need a chaplain telling me what battles to fight. Look, we don't get those hearts, we don't get water, and everyone dies. What's going on? I'm going back to the pens. I'll gut those machines myself. So machines did this? An Easterner with a hair like blood. The outlander from the embassy. You killed Greta, Regala's champion. He was one of ours. 
It's Aloy, and I'm not looking for any trouble. Well, maybe I could use some trouble right about now. Out there is a big herd my people harvest. We take the machine's hearts, send them to our capital, get paid with water. It gets harder every year. Killer machines keep showing up to defend the herd. Last one hit us right as we were penning up our prey. Nearly wiped us out. But our quarry is still in the pens, which means if I can get their hearts, we can trade for the water we need. If you go out there alone, you'll probably wind up dead, Draka. I'm not going alone, Chaplain. The great champion killer is coming with me. How about you answer some questions first? <laughs> what can you tell me about this herd? Been there for years. We harvest the parts we need from it. No more, no less. New machines always show up to replace our kills. What about the killer machines you mentioned? They guard the herd. The more we take out, the more arrive. First Sawtooths, then Ravagers. Now, a sandblasted Thunderjaw. Hit us right as we were herding machines into our pens. Had to leave half my hunters behind to fend it off. Only survivors are the ones you see here. You mentioned the capital gives you water. There's no giving. We pay tribute for it with machine parts. Parts being the most valuable. Every other desert village has some resource to exchange. But the capital of Scalding Spear is the only one with a constant supply of water. Here in dry country, it's the same as holding everyone's lives in their hands. It is the way of the desert. How we've always survived. Yeah. Doesn't sound like you like this commander of yours. Survival in the desert requires a more disciplined approach than that of other clans. It means she really likes her rules and order. But you don't. I just don't like hers. This is insubordination. Well, I must be dehydrated. I must I be I heard him calling you chaplain. What does that mean? It means I've survived our youth and outlived my brethren in many battles. As such, I counsel the Desert Clan. Those who reach my age are meant to share our wisdom with the young. Keep them on the true warrior's path when their stubbornness kicks up dust and clouds it. <laughs> you knew Regala's champion, Gruda. He was one of ours. So was Regala. Desert Clan's pride and joy. Why is she attacking her own people? She feels betrayed. Regala was a legend among our clan, fearless and unrelenting. A marshal to Hikaru, chief of all Tanakhth. His judgment made flesh. What changed? The Karja king asked for peace, and Hikaru agreed. Regala wanted payment in kind for the atrocities the Karja committed. A Tanakhth empire that would push into the east. So she challenged Hikaru's decision. He had no choice but to face her in combat. Hikaru won. She should have died by his hand then, but the chief let her live. For Tanakhth, that kind of mercy is a bitter drink. Now that she rides machines and murders marshals, we might not be able to ignore her camps in the desert for much longer. No one in the desert clan's touching those camps. This is between Regala and Hikaru. If the chief's strong enough to lead, he'll prevail. If he doesn't, he'll make way for one who is. That's a little harsh, isn't it? So is the desert. I'll help you harvest those pen machines if I can. Probably better if you don't do it on your own. Seems like your village needs you right now. I like her. An outlander after my own heart. We can leave now, or I can meet you at our outpost southeast of here. I have something to take care of first. You go on ahead. I'll wait at the outpost for as long as I can. May the Ten protect you then. I'll await your return and report to the capital. Yeah, you do that. Some sort of young dumbass. Food. I've heard 
of you, Outlander. Or I just said that. Let this battle be fought. Another time. Okay, so we're gonna continue on to what? Uh, Looks like that machine stores fluid in its tail. I don't know what does with it. I should be scanning more of these for the... Yeah, I should be scanning more creatures for the sake of uh, getting the uh, trophy for scanning all the cre uh, enemies. <laughs> Most of them, it's not a problem to uh, go back and find one at some point. Uh, there are a couple that you can only get during certain missions, and I will mention it as I go. Soldier warned me about them. Whatever they're doing, it can't be good. Good, good. We need to strengthen the defenses here. I 
and one and out the other. way may be the slowest way to do things by stealth and killing, but it's also the safest. doing here. We should give it up. Stay alert. Halt, Outlander. Trouble here.
I want to come this way. Close to the grass. Get closer to the grass. I don't know how people feel about uh, stealth levels, so uh, if this is boring, I I'm sorry. This is just, to me, it has always been my favorite play style. Is.
that rush whenever you think you might have been spotted, but you didn't. I should take a look in there. Might be a command center. Vigilance, everybody! Six Looks like they're getting ready to ship out these weapons and armor. Probably the rebels all over the west. Gonna hurt their operations if I get rid of them. No more mistakes! I want all eyes peeled! What do you have to report? Another watch. Another long watch. How do you like that? I won't back down. She's here! <laughs> Guys are friendly. Oh, they're not. Where's she gone, damn it? We got through it. We got through it. Examine this device. To all sons of Prometheus engineers and operatives, I've been hearing some belly aching, whining about the Tanakh, the work, the conditions. The occasional limb loss to a machine when someone gets careless. I get it. It's been a long road. We've suffered. We'll continue. This 
is actually an overall superior to us. You to suffer. But we're close. This alliance will get us what we want, I promise. The Karja will pay for the Red Raids in blood. And so will all of their collaborators in the Vanguard and back in the claim. So shut up. Get back to work and always remember. The reckoning is on the way. It sounds like the sons of Prometheus want blood. And the Karja are the target. The Vanguard, too. Let's see what else these guys have been up to. The rebels have been busy making weapons and armor. The map. It marks supply lines to different outposts. So I was right. This place makes weapons and armor, and ships them out to their troops. I should destroy as many munitions as possible. That should hurt the rebels' operations. So the sons of Prometheus are coming after the Karcha and the Vanguard. I need to find out more about their operations. And oh, stop them. Sneak in spot. There's such somewhere around here. We've got to knock the prisoner. They don't look too good. Champion killer. Are you here to wipe out these traitors? I'm here to help, so just follow my lead. Easy enough. Last one? That should be all of them. Guess the rebels will have to resupply elsewhere. Left. Either way, I think I'm done here. I don't think there's any more in me, so. So that took a little bit longer than I expected, but uh, we'll go ahead and end the episode here. Now, in between episodes, I'm probably going to do a little bit of resource gathering. So I'm going to try to get those wishbones. Maybe some of this stuff. Long story short, I think we're just going to... I'm just going to get some stuff and try to be ready to do some upgrades. 
But I think y'all... Actually, wait. Before we go, I got skill points. And since I have eight, let's go ahead and just... Boom. Boom. Let's me go full stealth. So, we spent all eight of that points. May not have been the best use of them, but hey. It's my playthrough. I'll do what I want to. But thanks again for watching. Uh, hope you all enjoy. Uh, if you are enjoying... Uh, and you've watched this far in the video, and you haven't already, go ahead and do me a favor and uh, hit the subscribe button. If not, then uh, that's cool too. That's cool too. Visit as much as you want. But, see y'all in the next one. Bye bye.